Hello friends, today I am in my parents' backyard and I am going to make my Mother's Day gift. So as you can see, my mom really loves gardening and planting things and all that kind of stuff. So I thought it would be really perfect to paint some pots for her to plant more plants in. I wanted to do a set of three, so I got this really big pot from Home Depot and I got these two smaller pots from Michaels. And I'm gonna paint them in a set of three. Oh, there's Forrest, hi Forrest. <laughs> oh, it's also May the 4th, so um, may the 4th be with you. I wanna go for kind of like a blue abstract, maybe kind of geometric look. I'm just gonna freestyle. So I just thought I'd take you along for the adventure and see what happens. So if you wanna do this project with me, whether it's for Mother's Day or any other time of the year, here are the things you're going to need. You'll need some terracotta pots, acrylic paint. I'm gonna mainly use white, blue, and yellow, and I'm gonna make green and blues out of these. After doing some research on painting terracotta pots, I found out that it's really great to seal it at the end with an acrylic sealer or finisher. I got this in matte, and this will help keep the paint intact and also it'll help if you have to like clean the pot um, you know it won't come off if it has this sealer <laughs> you're gonna need brushes these are the ones that I just found and I'm just gonna make these work I'm sure we have more in this house but you know sometimes the challenge is part of it and Forrest is checking it out all clear Forrest good okay thanks you're gonna need a plate of some sort or um, Oh my gosh, what is it called? Future Michelle, insert the other word here. But I'm gonna use a plate to mix my paints on. I got a cup of water and a paper towel to clean my brushes. And I usually like to go on Pinterest and make a little board for myself before I start a craft project, especially one that I'm not as comfortable with, like just freestyling. So I made this little small Pinterest board and it titled it Painted Pots and these are kind of the vibes that I'm going for. I think I'm really gonna like lean in towards like this kind of vibe where like there's colors but also random shapes. Um, I really like how this one has the pottery exposed and I really do like the color of terracotta so I was thinking of maybe leaving some terracotta exposed but we'll see how that goes. I liked the colors in this one. I love this little face, but I don't know if the face is really like part of the vibe I'm going for. This is cool. And then this is kind of similar to that, but with more colors. So the first thing I'm gonna do right now is mix some colors. Now, I don't completely know what colors I'm going for. I'm just gonna see what happens. And I know I'm gonna need a lot because that one pot is very large, so I'm starting out big. Uh-oh, this seems to be clogged. That's like so pretty. Okay, so like literally I'm just gonna start painting it with this.
So I think while I have this exact minty aqua color, I'm going to kind of do a similar thing as what I did there on the big pot and do it on the smaller pot so then they all have the same exact color before this either dries up or runs out. Now I'm going to do a second coat on all of the pots.
the painting is done all of the pots are drying and next I am just going to spray the acrylic sealer and finisher once uh, they're completely dry which it's pretty warm outside so it should be soon all right so all of the pots are painted and now I need to seal it with the acrylic sealer finisher so I brought the big one way over there wearing a mask glasses you know you don't want to inhale this stuff but uh, we're gonna seal this bad boy up the article I read said to do two coats, so we're gonna do that again. All right, two coats on the big boy, done. Hey, no, no, get away from there. Time to do the little babies. Coat one, done. <laughs> All right, these are the finished products. Oh. <laughs> I freaking love how they turned out. I think they look so cool. And they're like cute that they go together and I can't wait. Oh my God, Forrest. <laughs> I can't wait for my mom to see and put some beautiful plants in. Thanks for watching.